Las Vegas, home of the infamous Dead Man's Hand Poker Tournament. The game is Texas Hold'em, the prize is a mountain of gold doubloons, and the time to win it all is right now. Tonight, only four players remain, all of them intent on taking home that coveted trophy. The rookie with the Cinderella story. Thank you, Lucky Sandwich. The bully from Great Britain. Hey, nice hat, where's your legs? The man that refuses to lose. I hates me cards. And the veteran who makes his own luck. Who will be our new champion? Who will walk away with the severed hand of a dead sailor? The final table next on the WPPPT. Let's get right into the action here, Billy. And at the Dead Man's Hand Tournament, that can mean more than just cards. You're the dealer what dealt me seven deuce. Four huns in a row. <laughs> uh, bring us more grog. <laughs> <laughs> Colors, what say we make a side bet on this next hand? Mm. Whoever's cards be better than t'other, he cuts the loser's arm off. Oh, I am agreed, I am. Let's take a look at the chip count. Mulligan's in the lead, with just under half the coins in play, followed by Tom with nearly 2,000. I have the Jack of Diamonds and the Queen of Spades. What do you got? Just the five and six of diamonds. Well, fair be fair. Just lucky I'm drunk. You is me good friend, oh. so I will chop low. And with me sharpest tight blade. Oh! Looks like the first hand goes to the captain. Sometimes you don't need luck or skill to win as we learn from this week's Free Play. Of course you gamble when you're a pirate. <laughs> Gambling is like drinking or stealing or shooting your mate in the face. <laughs> I can't count with all my fingers how many players I've shot. What brought a lucky charm to the table? <laughs> I only shot them blokes on accounts I were jealous. Oh, Tutti were me lucky charm. And the only hand I won without him weren't even for money. <laughs> were for that blasted parrot. I'll tell you me worst poker type loss. Twere the time the giant turtle came crawling through the winder. And he swallowed me cards. And the table. But the table were a keg of gunpowder. And he blew us all to smithereens. <laughs> Bollocks to luck. Since I won that parrot, me good luck hit the end of the line. Lady Luck's gone back the other direction and I'm up to me color in turds. Back to action here at the Dead Man's Hand Tournament, and it's anybody's guess who will take home the prize. Tom checks his hold cards. With that pair of jacks, he will raise. Crothers with a king eight. Cool. Something's wrong with Mulligan, Bob. He's checking his hold cards again, and there's a... Uh... What is that? Well, I do believe that was a go fish card, James. Oh, I call. Oh, yeah, I call for sure. Now the captain's hold cards, he has a three, a four, and a five of spades. That's definitely one card too many. That extra card assures that he is not going to fold, John, and that he's cheating. Call is what I do. Who the say you Jimbo? Quit your belly aching, Tom. I ain't the one dealing. Well, we're four players to the flop, and it's queen, king, six. That gives Crothers a pair of kings and puts the captain one card away from a straight flush. Things certainly are heating up, mister. Tom is first to act. You know to cut. Oh, and he's <laughs> all in with two jacks. That is a dangerous bluff with the higher king and queen on the board. That makes this our marchingdog.com all-in moment. Crothers is quick to call, and that'll put all of his chips on the line. Mulligan doesn't look like he knows what to do. Oh, I got an ace and a mackerel, and those are really good cards. And do I want to fold good cards like an ace? And who knows, the next time I'm going to get a card like a mackerel. Is he telling the other players the cards in his hand? <laughs> it certainly appears that way, Jimmy. 
Oh, looks like Tom's cheating as well, Carol. <laughs> That's right. I have no clue how he did it, but he traded his jacks for queens. Are you wants to call? Make up your mind, you great sissy. Oh, I called. Oh, oh boy. I called. I called! Mulligan now in a deep hole, with half of his chips at risk here. <laughs> and the captain calls right behind him, which will put everyone Two all in. Two or seven. Two or seven! Two! Kings. Seven! Kings. 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 I should have seen that coming. And this is why the Dead Man's Hand Tournament is my favorite event to cover, Winona. Double down! Double down! Curse your bird! Get the blazes off the table! <laughs> This card. Good luck, gentlemen. Oh! Eight of diamonds. That doesn't help anybody, and Tom wins the pot. See in hell, eight of diamonds! <laughs> Who says cheaters never win, John? Tom knocks out the captain and Crothers with those three queens. Hold on. That blast made by the captain seems to have exposed something in the center of the table, Gary. You're right, Lance. There's definitely something hidden just under the felt. What is it? Fills me with fear, it does. Sender Sayonata. I gotta take a crap. It's what makes poker the fastest growing sport in the world today. Winners, losers, hands folded, arms chopped off, bombs, skulls, grog, and fish. For Leslie Sebastian Charles, I'm Hal Vukovic. Thanks for joining us here at the WPPPT.